All right, so if you're watching this, you're having trouble with the extended dialog interface. Now this is going to be a tutorial for version 1.14b. Any other version is non-applicable to this tutorial, so be sure on what version you're going to be using or troubleshooting with. So in its current form, it does not work. And to get it working, you need to download Fallout 4 Edit. And you do that by clicking on the manual download page, I'll put a link in the description. And once you download it, you need to extract it to an external folder or your desktop, which is fine. And once you download it, you can just run it. It detects your installation automatically, and... Alright, this should pop up. When this little thing I'm dragging around right here, when this pops up, you want to make sure you have xdi.esm loaded, well, in this list, or else you're doing it for nothing. And tips should pop up in. You can just ignore it. Alright, so once it's loading, look in the left list and locate xdi.esm. So what you want to do is right click on xdi.esm and go just select add masters. You just need to add Fallout 4. It should appear on this list. If it doesn't, you might need to reinstall Fallout 4. But again, this only applies to version 1.14b. Any other version, this is not applicable to. Alright? So once you, once you click that and hit OK, you hit... If some text should show up here, you should say done, and you can close out of this, and it'll ask you to save, and you hit OK. Now, once you do that, go to Nexus Mod Manager, or whatever you use to load Fallout 4, and Fallout4.esm should appear right here. If it doesn't appear right here, you've done something wrong, or something has gone horribly wrong, or I don't know how to end this video. Thanks for watching.